In the waters of the Gulf of Mexico, something is making prized catches like red snapper and grouper sick. Some fish have sores, weird black streaks, parasites never before seen. Why? Fish with most of the pre prevalence of these diseases are the animals that live close or on the bottom. It is possible the 2010 oil spill from the deep water horizon may be a factor. Work of the University of South Florida is being funded from a $500 million grant set up by BP, part of what the oil giant has to pay in compensation. But no one really knows why fish are getting sick. Research seems to show an unusually high percentage of sick-looking fish live in areas hit hardest by the spill. You know, it occurs more um, uh, likely up there than it does off the Florida coast, which is probably a, a good indication of it. But there are also other factors up there. I mean, there's a large developed oil industry with pipelines and other things. So even if it's oil-related, it may not be deep water horizons. The fish so far do not appear to be a danger for human consumption. What is complicating any diagnosis or link to the 200 million gallon oil spill is that not much is known about the normal rate of disease among fish. Until the BP spill, no one cataloged the rate of fish illness in the Gulf. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.